Hello everyone, here is Dr. Benaduce. So what's going on in this video? We see a blood vessel that's getting enlarged right here. The first step is to remember that we have arteries and veins. And arteries are the blood vessels that take blood away from the heart. Now the heart is the organ that generates the blood pressure, right? Because it pumps blood out into the arteries. And for the arteries to sustain this, to handle this blood pressure, they have a very thick wall. They have a good smooth muscle layer. And sometimes you have like even elastic fibers in the wall of arteries. So they can handle this blood pressure. When we look at veins, veins barely have any blood pressure. And then what we have in the wall of veins is very thin layer of smooth muscle. We don't have these elastic fibers because it's really not necessary. Also, because arteries are handling this high blood pressure, the arteries in our body, they are hidden, they are deeper. And veins, they are found closer to the surface because if you puncture veins, you will not lose lots of blood in a short period of time. So taking this all into consideration and we see a blood vessel right here, you can conclude that is a vein. And since veins have a very thin wall because they really don't need this thick, good, smooth muscle layer and also the elastic fibers to handle high blood pressure, what we see is that veins have an easier time getting distended. And then we have this blood vessel right here, which is the blood vessel that removes blood from our head. So that will be the jugular vein. And the pair for the jugular vein is the carotid artery. Now we have the external jugular vein, which obviously is more external when we compare to the internal jugular vein. And this blood vessel that you're seeing getting enlarged in the neck of the girl is literally the external jugular vein. So if this vein is getting distended, it is because we have a problem with the blood that's arriving at the heart and that blood is not moving the way it's supposed to be moving. So you have this backup of blood and since blood is not draining into the heart as it should be, go draining you have the blood backing up back, back, backing up backing up and then you see this vein getting enlarged since veins have a blood vessel wall a wall much thinner you can really see that it gets distended as we have this problem with the blood going back to the heart i hope this was helpful and i will see you in the next video bye